Tristan, I'm tired of watching this. This is my favorite movie. Hey, my favorite kiddo. Look what mama got you. Hey, mom. Whoa, mom, you got me some shoes? You like them? Where's Fallen's shoes? Um, they're on your feet. <laughs> it's okay, Tristan, don't worry. You can enjoy your gifts, I'll be fine. Thank you, but I'll talk to him. <sighs> yes, ma'am. Son. Take your stuff to your room and talk to your sister. Yes, ma'am. You are not his mother. I am. Yes, ma'am. I put your charge when I'm gone. When I'm here, your input is not needed. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry. Who do you think you are? You think you're better than me? No, ma'am. I don't think that at all. It's because you got it. Pretty face, pretty hair. You are not better than me. I'm sorry, I don't know what I did. It's everything, everything about you. I, 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 I what? I'm sorry, Mom. Yeah, you should be. You need to go find a job. You need to go fend for yourself. Oh, and by the way, Got you something. I think you need these. Got that musty smell and smelly breath. Go clean yourself up. How do you think you're ever gonna find a job looking like that? Yes, ma'am. Go, go, get out of here. Girl, you finally decided to come over. <laughs> yeah, finally. <laughs> You know, I missed a couple days, but tell me what's going on at that job. Girl, Flynn thinks she got the promotion. What? She must not know. What? You think <laughs> you already got it? How you know? <laughs> Girl, I know I got it. Come on. Okay, calm down. I like how you got all this confidence. Girl, you got that confidence too. Nobody gonna take anything from me. Okay. I, I worked hard for mine. Okay, well don't do nothing too crazy. Girl, I'm gonna do what I gotta do. Anyway, how you been? Well, you know, everything's been copacetic for the most part. Where's your son? Uh, he's in the back. Okay, I'm gonna go say hi. Uh, be careful. Uh, family got some issues going on back there, uh, so it might be a little musty. But you only had a son. No, girl, I got. And was she run out of the <laughs> other or something? Girl, mind your business. Come in. Hey guys, I'm your mom's work friend, Monica. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Fallon and this is my little brother, Tristan. It's nice to meet you. Oh, you guys are so well-mannered. How old are you? I'm seven and my sister taught me to mind my manners so I won't get in trouble like her. I don't like when she's in trouble. Is everything okay, Fallon? Why do you keep getting in trouble? Is there anything I can do to help? If I knew, I'd tell you, but unfortunately, I don't. I guess it's the way I smell, but I don't choose to smell like this. I mean, do you not have what you need? Can't use your mom's if you run out? <laughs> if I used her stuff, she'd probably kill me. She'd probably say that I'm trying to smell better than her or something. Why do you feel like that? Look, just forget I even said anything. I know that even though my mom treats me poorly sometimes, she really does love me just deep down inside of her. Well, sounds to me like you're being neglected, and that's not love. Look, can you please just drop it? I really just need to know if you know where I can find a job. Actually, I do. How old are you? I'm 16. Okay, it's a customer service job that my friend works at. I'll tell her about your situation. I'm sure she'll help out. I ran out of wine. I'm about to go get some more. I'm okay. I think I'm going to head out. Okay, well, I'm going. Fallon, please watch over my child. Yes, ma'am. So what size you wear? I wear a size one in smaller shirts, I think. Let me see your phone. What I'm gonna do is give you my number. I'm gonna get you some professional attire and I'm gonna help you with this interview. Thank you, you don't know how much this really means to me. 
It's okay, sweetheart. Once you turn 18, all of this will be over. I'll see you soon, okay? Okay. Bye. Bye. Can you please help me find a manager or something? I'm the manager. Oh, where have you been? I've been working. I worked every day so I wouldn't have to come home. And I mean, most nights I just slept here. So you just get a job and leave us? I just couldn't continue to lay my head where I wasn't wanted. That was me fixing it for me. I lost everything because of you. You lost everything because of who you decided to be as a person. I had to open my eyes and realize that what I was getting wasn't love. I did what I had to do for you. And now you're showing me you're ungrateful for it? Ungrateful? I'm ungrateful? I had nothing to be grateful for besides Tristan. What did I even do to make you treat me this way? You really want to know? Do you? Yes, I do. I need an explanation. You are your father's daughter. He took advantage of me. I didn't know what to do. I was alone. I was young. I decided to keep you. And then I realized I made a mistake. So you hate me because of what my father did to you? It wasn't just about you. But yes. I'm not my father, and I didn't deserve any of that. I already didn't have a dad, and the one parent that I actually needed, you couldn't even be there. Look, I was wrong. Let's not hang on the past. Where's Tristan? He's with his father. Are you just gonna ignore me? What do you want me to say? There's nothing to say. Hey, hey, wait. I need your help. I got $40. I got evicted from my apartment. Can you please help me get a room? I can't do that. Look, I'm your mother. You want me to sleep on the street? Look, I would never do you the way you've done me, but I can't do that. It's just our policy. Okay, fine. I deserve this. You got three nights. I'll pay for your room for three nights. After that, you gotta figure something else out. Thank you, thank you so much. You're welcome. Follow me. Hey guys, thank you for watching Family Cron, but make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and turn on those notifications so you'll know when we drop new videos. Thanks for watching.